Hello. Hello, dear friends. This is Masile. We are going to say the Seven Sorrows Rosary. Hello, guys. Hello, hello. Hello from Rwanda. <laughs> Let me invite my friend, my new friend, Christine, who does so good with the rosary. Thank you so much for joining. Okay, one second. Uh, thank you, thank you. So good to see you. We are going to pray the seven sorrows together from Rwanda, from Africa. <laughs> so waiting for Christine. Okay, come in, come in, Christine. Yes. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. So good to see you. We are going to say the Seven Sorrows Rosary together. It's so good. Oh, from Cancer, Janet, to Neil. Oh, this is beautiful. <laughs> it's so good to see many of you. <laughs> so waiting for my friend to come so that we can start our Seven Sorrows Rosary. As you can see, I'm in Rwanda. I don't know if you can see it when you see a lot of bushes around here. <laughs> so it's really nice to, to, to see you. <laughs> oh, why? Why? Why is Mary? I am trying. I'm inviting many Hail Marys. Invite again. Oh. See, so you're waiting for. Oh, wow. Why is it? So I'm, I'm inviting our friend to join us so that we can start praying together. Oh, thank you. I love you too. I love you too. Oh, from Ireland. Oh, how nice. Maryland. Very nice. So I'm inviting my friend to join me. Yes, here I am. Okay. Hello. Oh, finally. <laughs> good. Yep. Very good afternoon oh, yeah. here. How are you? Oh, oh so good, good to see, see you. you. Good, good. This is this is Kigali. I'm in Kigali. Wow. Look at that. There's a lot of flowers moving around. Our lady behind beautiful. here, a little chapel. So beautiful. <laughs> When you, you, oh, when you come to visit me, all of you guys, when you come to the pilgrimage to Kibeho, oh, look, I am dressed like our lady of Kibeho. I love it. I love it. <laughs> I, oh, thank you. I arrived yesterday. Thank you, Christine, for what you do with your, your, your page, oh. Many Hail Marys at the time. I truly just have admired you so much for how many people you are bringing to oh. God and to our lady. And uh, God bless you. Thank you to our lady, yeah. right? In, in her rosary and I'm excited to yeah. pray this seven rosary. rosary with you too as well. Yeah. Amen. Yes. Oh, thank you. Thank yeah. you. Anyway, before we start, do you, can you say just a few minutes, how did you even, you know, to pray like you pray, there is definitely a moment when you say, I met our lady, I met God this time. I connected to her this time. What happened? Anything you want to share with um, us before so we I start? First off, Thank you to you, because um, I think a pivotal moment was truly reading um, your book, Left to Tell. And then, um, yeah, that oh, was, thank you. I think, really filled my heart with hope to try again. Because as a child, I yeah. always witnessed oh. my grandma praying and also my mom praying it. But I didn't understand it at the time. And then mm. um, I would say when it really mm -hmm. became more of a daily habit or a practice that I wanted to ensure I did every day um, was when it was about 10 years ago, mm -hmm. um, we were pregnant with our third child and um, my spouse had just lost his job and Lent, and Lent was around the corner oh, and just very uncertain times. It was mm -hmm. 2011 and there was still the 
the financial crisis. And so as a family, we started praying the rosary every day. And we didn't pray it well because mm-hmm. we didn't mm-hmm. know all of the meditations and the mysteries. But um, but what was a constant yes. throughout that period was peace and a surrender. And, wow. and it really kind of brought us together mm-hmm. in a time when things were just very scary. Um, and then it was... Yes. And you kind of don't understand, but you have that peace. You're like, wait, I'm not supposed to have peace, yes. but I, I have it, right? That's when you yes. know it's supernatural that yes. comes from the rosary, from yes. God. Yeah. It, it's it just, oh. she, she oh. really, it's like she takes those worries and, and you feel that you can surrender and that yes. you really are 100% taken care of. And, oh. and I think Amen. during when you, you, it's a, it's something I think for you have to start just praying it to really understand and realize this peace that comes. And, and I think that was, she was so there for us during that period. And, um, and after you, you can't do without, right. And all of a sudden you cannot do without you realize that no friend, nothing can bring you that peace that come from the rosary. Right. Yes. Yes. Yeah. That's so beautiful. Yeah. And you know, one, one of the message our lady have given, she said, you start to pray. To start to pray is your, your decision. But the joy that comes with prayer, it comes from God. It's a grace God gives. Amen. And she repeats many times, pray until prayer becomes a joy for you. And yesterday, I, when I left the U.S. and I came to Rwanda, you know, I have some work actually here for Our Lady. She, some of the plans she, she asked for in Kibeho. And in the plan, I'm like, okay, I'm alone. Usually I'm traveling with people, family. But it was just like I'm crying because I feel like Jesus and Mary were like sitting both sides. I'm like, oh, we're together now. And I'm like, I can be myself. Nobody knows me. So I was like crying, saying the rosary, just crying. But oh, crying of joy. It was, I'm like, wow, so you really mean it. I was telling our lady, you really mean it. That prayer yes. can become oh. a joy. How yes. nice, eh? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So thank you so much again, our lady. Ask us, my children, I need you. Help me. Help me. Help me to reach other children. So here we are. Now we are going to start praying. But you are such one of those seeds. Our Lord gave so much uh, blessings and then you took it and took it to other people. Oh, thank you. And that's what we need to do, guys. So as we pray, think of somebody you can reach, somebody you can help. Somebody you can revive their faith, you know, because there is praying that brings so much joy, but also sharing that prayer with somebody, it brings even another special joy. And Our Lady always reward us. She is a good rewarder. Yes. She pays very well. She gives you good friends. She, she, yes, how, look at friendship. Oh, it's so good. Look at, oh, yeah. The right? Always it's friendship, friendship. Yes. yeah. She promised. Right. That is one of the things she said in the Kibeho. She said, my children, you will never be, you, you decide for God, you will never be alone or lonely. How? Yeah. So it's like, cause sometimes we're scared to lose friends. And you sometimes will be we don't want to, the yeah. best of friends. <laughs> the best. Yes. Yes. Oh, and believe me, I have been there. I am there sometimes. Then I'm like, wait, even with what you left to tell, which, uh, you know, you, you mentioned a little bit. I felt that my, one of my fears was that, how can I live without my mom, my dad, my grandma, my grandpa, uncles, how, what is life is about? But I feel like I have gained the whole world. You know, once you love, once you, you love people, you love God, he really makes you realize that. Look at all these people. You are not alone. You can't say you are alone. Yes. <laughs> I am not. Yes. Yeah. Oh. Thank no, you. Thank you. Yeah. I'm excited to pray the seven sorrows with you. Thank <laughs> you. Good. Yeah. Thank you. So thank you, Trudy. Thank you, everyone. Like I always say, continue to put your intentions and they will remain here so people can continue to pray for one another throughout the plan. I'm like, let me remember this intention, this intention, the one that was with Christine, somebody said, it's just like you see them and then in your rosary, our God is rich. 
You can't say, let me give him these little intentions. Mm. You can give him so many because he's such so generous, a, a rich yeah. God and, and he's powerful. Mm. Yeah, mm. so generous and powerful. So whatever you have in your heart, just our job, our, our task is to try to pray from the heart, to mean what we say, to come from the heart. That is the most important thing. And one thing our lady used to tell us in Kibeho, if there is anything that have to make you unhappy, let it be your sins, your own sins. Only thing that should ever worry us. And, and yeah, and when I go there, I'm like, oh, how can I say that? You know, I should never have that. And it bothers you, but we also remember it is our, our, our Lord is merciful. And our, our lady is a mother of mercy. Yeah. So thank you, dear friend, again. So let's start. And for so many people who are draining us, for marriages, for families, for healing of the body or the soul, and, and the physical, and for the healing of our church, our countries, for peace, peace first in our own hearts. So let's start this rosary. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Oh my God, I offer you this rosary for your glory, and to honor your Holy Mother, the Blessed Virgin, so that I can share and meditate upon her suffering. I humbly beg you to give me true repentance for all my sins. Give me wisdom and humility so that I may receive all the indulgences contained in this prayer. Amen. Act of contrition. Oh my God, I am heartily sorry for having offended you. And I detest all my sins because I dread the loss of heaven and risk the pains of hell. But most of all, because they offend you, my God. You who are all good and deserving of all my love, I firmly resolve with the help of your grace to confess my sins, to do penance, and to amend my life. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit Holy of thy womb, Jesus. Of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Dear Mother, for those who are suffering with anxieties, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit Holy of thy womb, Mother Jesus. God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your son, Jesus. So the first sorrow is a prophecy of Simeon. This is a rosary when Our Lady told us, my children, when you think about this, put yourself there. Ask yourself, what would I feel? What if it was me? And that is how our dear mother reaches out in our hearts and is able to heal us. Because then we are able also to open our hearts slowly to speak to her. To share with her, because you can't put yourself in somebody's shoes unless you can say, did I ever feel anything where maybe I received bad news in a time when I was supposed to be joyful and hide hurt? How my world was lost because, you know, was upside down? Maybe sometimes that might have happened to you. Maybe you find out about a sickness. Maybe you found out somebody you love was, was not well. This is a time we need to give it to our dear mother. What if it was you? Speak to her. The news she received were heavy in her hearts. And she understands what you go through. She wants to give you a hand so that she can help you because she understands what it feels like. Dear Father, we offer you our sufferings. We offer you our intentions. Through the tears of our dear Mother Mary, she cried that time when she received bad news about her child. When he was just 40 days, and for rest of, the rest of his life, she watched him, wondering when he's coming, what is coming. Her heart never became the same, just for joy, but she was also suffering with it for what was going to come, even when Jesus was still a baby. So our Lord knows that in this life we go through suffering, but he's with us because he's God of mercy. He's a healing God. We thank you. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. This is day our daily bread. Give us this day our daily bread. As we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Uh, Christine, anybody you can think of who have an intention, maybe somebody who is suffering, we can offer um, this next seven can I offer um, this up for any of those who at the Many Hill Marys at a Time community are really enduring suffering um, or who may be um, suffering internally, whether it's mental health or it's a physical health. Yes. So yeah, I want to pray for them. They are, yes, they are Yes, may dear God hear us, all of us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And I pray for those who have cancer. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For those who need jobs, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For families, for peace in couples and their children, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful Mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your son, Jesus. The second sorrow, the flight into Egypt. I have come to love the seven sorrows very much because... You know, you have read left to tell in so many ways. Anytime I think about my mom or my dad and remember how much they loved me, it's always about something they did when we were suffering. The nights my mom didn't go to sleep because I was sick. My father, when he had to rush me to the hospital or take my brother, that's when I said, wow, he really loved me. Somebody who is able to suffer with you, somebody who is able to think of your pain and, and love you through that, that's your friend. And when we think about the suffering of Jesus and Mary, I feel so close to them. Because it's not just about the joy, which is the joy is necessary. But we are thinking about their suffering. I think we are much closer to them like this. And the more we are closer to them emotionally, the more their, their graces are working in your life too, emotionally. The more that healing is coming. That's why Our Lady Nikibeho, she said, the seven sorrows rosary is a gift of our time. The time where people are confused. The time sicknesses are different. This is the time to pray for addictions. This is the time where people have lost the, their ways. She says, the seven sorrows will bring them to the way. Healings will be given more than ever before. And she even said, if you pray for somebody, the graces will act on them as if they prayed it for themselves. So this is a gift we have to think of Jesus, to go intimately. When I was play, praying yesterday in the plane, I was like, oh, I'm sitting around Jesus. We were so intimate. <laughs> we're just like crying, like, oh, you cried. It must have been so bad. Mm -hmm. You know, when you carry the cross and, or through the sorrows of my mother, how can, you, how can this happen to you? You were the, who was the most beautiful, the most gentle, the most mm -hmm. kind, the most pure. How can this be? And also this helps me to know, of course, we all go through our own suffering. If I go su through suffering, why am I co complaining? I should rather ask God to help me more than complaining. Because if God can go through that, if the mother of God can go through that, who am I to say, why me? So let's ask our lady to receive our suffering. 
Remember the way to Egypt. They didn't have a place to go to. They just left. You know, they just went. And on the way in Kibeho, she told us, I suffered because Jesus was hungry and he was crying and I didn't have much help for him. What a mother suffers. So may dear God also have mercy for you. We know our lady is not now on the way to Egypt. Even if she suffers for us, she is the queen of heaven and earth. And nothing is impossible to her. Because through her son, through the power God has given her, she can answer all our prayers and give us the graces we need to be more faithful and to love God even more. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. And for those who are making changes in their life and they are not sure of tomorrow, we pray, dear Mother, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Dear Mother, for peace between mothers and their daughters and sons with their fathers, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For end of divorce and for the husbands and wives to love each other and be united. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit Holy of thy womb, Mary, Jesus. Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For souls of purgatory, especially in our families as we are praying together, and those we pray for. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For our children and their future, and peaceful future, and faithful future, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For the students among us or our children, may dear God help them in the, the exams and in their studies and lead them to him. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful Mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your son, Jesus. The third sorrow Again, this is a rosary our lady said, my children, take a little moment, think about me. Don't rush through them. You know, when we tell somebody about our pain and they're like, oh good, okay, sorry, what next? How, how painful that is. Eh? So then our lady also in Kibeho, she told us, take a little moment, feel about what I felt. So the third sorrow is when our lady lost in St. Joseph, they lost Jesus for three days. Imagine what that was for a mother to lose her child for three days. And Our Lady reminded us in the Kibeho, Jesus was not just a child, but Jesus was her God. So to lose him, she felt lost completely. She felt more pain than any mother can ever feel. So what that was for her. And what really I, just amazes me, and with all this suffering, you never sinned once? But she's pure. She was. She never sinned. She's the immaculate conception. She's the most pure. She never sinned. We complain. We want other people to hurt when we hurt. We, we, you know, I can see turning against her husband. It's like, where were you looking? You know, you should have watched him. No, she was gentle. And every home she knocked the door, they told her they haven't seen him. She wanted to die. but She kept looking. And like all of us, we have to keep looking for Jesus in our life. And we have to try to forgive. And when we can't forgive, we have to ask for more strength to forgive. 
people make mistakes. People don't look. People sometimes they hurt you on purpose, but they really don't even know the consequences. May dear God, please help us to love each other even when we are suffering. I want to especially pray for people who are being trafficked all over the world, our countries where we come from, people who are being, you know, children who are stolen. May dear God help. And I really want to pray for many people who, who give their lives also to help, to help to rescue children. And I want to pray for people who have children who are addiction, who are, you know, have addictions. Because those mothers, those fathers, they just feel like you have lost your child. And also for anyone who is battling any addiction, may their God give you strength. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Any group you want to pray for? You know, I was, th- uh, I was thinking of for anyone. Um, the families and the children who have, have left the faith. Um, and they feel that mm-hmm. yeah, they want to pray for their yes. conversion. Or we want to pray for their conversion, yeah. Amen. Amen, amen. May the God hear us. And for those who are being persecuted, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy Holy womb, Mary, Jesus. Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Our Lady Nikibeho, she said, even one Hail Mary that says, said, prayed from the heart is like throwing a bomb in the plans of the devil. The plans he has for you, for your children, to hurt you, your home, your work. Pray, pray, pray. She, it is the greatest power. There's no other place I'd rather be than being with you right now, just praying. Because prayer to connect with God is to connect to the power from heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And yes, for our countries and for the good people who are doing so much to reach others, to help them pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I pray for this Hail Mary for people to love confession because it is a healing place to confess to God. If you're not Catholic, of course, speak to God from your heart sincerely. But if you can, to go to a priest. We benefit from the power of God through the priest, but also with the counseling of priest gives you in confession. I try to go every month, every two weeks, actually. But Our Lady have said at least once a month. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And yes, for those who have been abused and who carry the pain and the wounds of being abused. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful Mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your son, Jesus. That beginning prayer, the, pray, uh, the prayer before the sorrow, Even that is powerful when you think about that. Put your heart there. Remind us always. Because, you know, when we remember what Jesus has gone through for us, it is then we know how much we are loved. He went to the cross for us. He died for us. He took the pain. He took the bullet for you. How much he cares for you individually. And when people know they are loved, there is nothing more. There's no more care. As long as I know you care. People are hurt so much. 
because they know or somebody have heard them and they think nobody cares. When they feel, what, you love me that much? Then you have the strength to go on. So I pray that you may know what our Lord have given you. The fourth sorrow our lady made Jesus on the way to the cross. Imagine Jesus carrying the cross and his mother, what she felt, covered by blood, the wounds all over his body. And guess what? He was God and he was innocent. This was a part of the rosary that blew my mind when I was going through the genocide and I was hiding for three months in a bathroom of three by four feet with other seven women. So I remember thinking, complaining, like, it's worse than being a prisoner. How can I be here? You know, you're crying, but it doesn't help. You can complain as much as you, you want. It doesn't help. It's turning to God that does something. So when I was praying that, the this, this first sort of like, what? Wait, you are God? You could have changed it. You didn't? Why? There was only answer. Because I love you. Because I care for you. I took that pain for you. And for today, if you doubt you are loved, just remember what Jesus took for you, that cross, and how he took even his mother to be a part of that sacrifice. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in give heaven. Us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And I want to pray for those who are fearful, who are scared. One time I went to speak in a college. I, this lady had haunted me, and of course, not haunted, but is the Holy Spirit reminds me to pray for her. And this one young woman, she came to me and she said, you forgive, but how do you forgive somebody you are scared of and who is still in your life? Oh, and that broke my heart. And I continued to pray for her, whoever she was scared, because I asked her, any, any help I can give? And then she walked away crying. How do you forgive somebody when you are scared of them? So for those who are fearful, for those who are scared, may their God give you peace. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And for every country you are calling from, your nationalities, your new nationality, where you live, may their God bless you and bless your family and your country. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For my fellow Rwandans, now I, I have, as I told you, I just arrived in Rwanda. I have some mission in Kibeho, some work for a lady. Please pray for us that everything goes well. So I pray for this country and their people who have suffered so much, but who are fighting hard. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for America and for all Americans and a beautiful country, our my home too. And may their God bless America and protect it from all its enemies. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For those who are tra planning trips, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For end of the war in Ukraine, Russia, and Europe, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful Mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your Son, Jesus. The fifth sorrow, Our Lady, stand at the foot of the cross. Imagine what a mother that was like for her, 
because we have to come out of our hearts and, and try to, to think for, you know, be there for her. Suppose you were there and his mother is going through that. What? Her son has nails in his body. Her son is covered by wounds. Her son is taking his last breath and is calling to the father, why have you forsaken me? That shows you where desperation was, how bad it was. But of course, our Lord taught us a big lesson. Even when it is hard for us, let's say, not my will, but you will. Because in the end, at the end of every suffering, God will always bring a good fruit. A suffering where suffered always bear good fruit. And suffering where is to pray with, is to suffer without complaining, without blaming necessary. You know, you know what happened, but pray. Pray in your suffering. We love you, Jesus. We thank you so much for what you have done for us. And I want you, please, I pray that your blood touch every one of us. Cleanse us. Give us a new life. Heal us even the sicknesses we don't know. And help us in our own work. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. This day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Lifting up all your intentions, all is written here. But Christine, anyone you want to pray yeah, for? I'd like to pray for anyone who's grieving or anyone who's lost a child. Mm -hmm. Oh, dear God, come to their help. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I pray for a strong faith for all of us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. And yes, for all the children in foster care and all their cares. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Dear Mother, I pray again for couples, for peace and love, as there was love between you and St. Joseph. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your son, Jesus. The sick sorrow, Our Lady receives the body of our Lord. This sorrow breaks my heart. Especially Our Lady one time in Kibeho, you know, she explained a lot to Marie Claire, who was a visionary she gave it to. She said when she was washing Jesus, his body, her heart broke when she saw how many wounds they have caused his body. Because it was then she was able to see it. And then she said, she started to think about every stage of his life. She started to think about every stage of his life when he was born when he was, you know, laughing, smiling, when they ran to Egypt, when he started to talk, when he started to preach, just like a mother. I mean, I go through a lot in the pain of my family. Sometimes I, I cried, just remembering my brother when he, he was laughing, the things we talked about. To this day, I still go through that and I end up crying. And that is the moment when you feel intimate with people and the suffering is so deep. And so I want to offer you, to God, all your suffering, dear mother, all our suffering. We know now that you are in heaven, body and soul, 
you are here to with us in our hearts and you intercede for us. You understand every suffering. Mother, please hug every one of us that we know you have touched us and we know you can, Mother. You touch us in so many ways. You send these signal graces that we know that you are with us. So I ask you on behalf of my brothers and sisters that you might touch each one of us so that they know they ha you have heard their prayers. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. This day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Last time I asked you to pray for somebody who have fell on, um, he was doing some work for us and he fell from the house, like in like 15 meters. We don't know how this man was still alive. And he was in hospital, but no bone was broken. And then yesterday we spoke to him and he told us, he said, when I fell, I felt something held me. I thought there was a tree on the way. No tree was on the way. I truly believe it was your prayers as we pray that our lady pick him up from the air he fell down from like 15 meters nobody can understand how nothing was even broken so i am love our lady just know that she really does hear us Hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee blessed are you among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb Holy jesus mary mother of god pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death amen Hail mary full of grace the lord is with thee Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For those who are suffering, hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Let's pray even for divorced couples. You never know. God has reconciled many people. Nothing is impossible. If he can resurrect the dead, he can also resurrect a dead marriage. So I pray for families. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For conversion of people, Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your son, Jesus. This seven sorrow, the body of our Lord was placed in a tomb. Imagine what that was like for a mother when you know that your child is buried and what has, she, what has he done? Nothing. He was not just good, but he was a perfect man, the best of all. And that what happened? I pray that you may accept our suffering and continue to offer them to God, but that you find nothing too heavy. Because if this can happen to the perfect person in the world, who are we to say, why did they do this? Of course they did it. It's wrong. Whatever wrong was done to you. But it's easier when we are able to accept our suffering. So I pray for strength for you to accept suffering, whatever you might have gone through. One time I heard uh, this little Jacinta from, from Fatima, she told her sister, I mean, Lucia, she said, Lucia, you are so lucky. Your mom is, doesn't believe you. So you go through a lot of more suffering than us because our parents believe us. So you have more suffering to offer to God. I'm like, what? A kid can understand how our suffering, we can offer them to God and they can bear fruits. She considers the one who is suffering lucky. So imagine if we can see ourselves lucky because of the problems and the suffering we are going through. We won't complain so, 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 so much. 
So maybe I got to give us a grace to accept because of course, sometimes it is unbearable. And I pray for those who are desperate, those who really feel like there's no way out. May their God come to their help. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Yep, that's my dog. <laughs> Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For strength to overcome, to overcome bad habits. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For our politicians, may their God lead their minds to make good decisions for people. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For our priests, especially for the priests I know, one in my family, Father Valence, Father Leshek, Father John, we pray with. I pray for them, for their God to give them strength. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Our Lord have told us where two or three are together, he's between them. So dear Jesus, I beg you to touch each one of us. Hear our intentions. Hear our weaknesses. Heal them. Hear our sins. Please forgive us, Father. We love you. We don't want to offend you ever, but we are weak. We beg you that our prayers may reach your heart as we are sinners. We put them through the hands of dear Mother Mary. You love so much. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Holy Jesus. Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. For our Pope and for the Vatican, and everyone there who make decisions for the whole world church, may their God lead them. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I want to pray an extra Hail Mary for the intentions of Our Lady in Kibeho, for the intentions of our Lord for Kibeho, because there's a lot he have done, he have asked for, not yet done. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Most merciful Mother, remind us always about the sorrows of your son, Jesus. The ending prayer, Queen of Maltas, your heart suffered so much. We beg you by the merits of the tears you shed in those terrible and sorrowful times to obtain for me and all the sinners of the world the grace of complete sincerity and repentance. And three times we say, Mary who was conceived without sin and who suffered for us, pray for us. Mary who was conceived without sin and who suffered for us, pray for us. Mary who was conceived without sin and who suffered for us, pray for us. Say, my court, Archangel, defend us in the battles. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirit who prowls around the world, seeking the ruins of the souls. Amen. Our Lady of Kibeho, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much, Christine. I, this was so oh, yeah. This you. was so I beautiful. I wanted to try to show you guys the mountains, but I don't yeah. know if you can see them. Yeah, I don't know if you can oh, see wow. them. Oh wow! So wow, where is that? 
Can you see? Oh, I can see them. God is so good. God is so good. Yes, I can definitely. I know. Oh, that. It, oh. This is so. Where is that? Utah, like the mountains in Utah. Yeah. Oh, Utah. It's, it's so beautiful. Oh, I love Utah. And no. Do you no, live in the Utah? Chicago. We're just here for a night, so we actually fly okay. back in a little bit here. But thank oh, you, nice. thank you so much. Oh, we God. don't have to do our live rosary at many Hail Marys at a time. Um. Yeah, it's um okay. but thank you. Thank you. This is so Good. beautiful. Yeah. Thank you all so much. Thank you. And God bless oh. you. Continue yeah. to remind people how our lady is just amazing, how beautiful and how present. I, one time in Ikibeho she appeared during the night. I think I don't know if I shared this last time. She appeared during the night. Everybody saw the ball of light that brought her. And then she told the visionary, I wanted to show my children that even when you are sleeping, I'm watching over you. So she does watch yeah. over us. So oh, God, God bless, bless you again you. for what you do. Love yeah, you. read everyone for me. <laughs> okay. Bye. Okay, my dear. Bye. Bye, guys. See, see you Friday. Friday, we are going to pray again. Oh, thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. Look, look, look. This is Rwanda. Oh, me, I can't show you the mountains easy, but it's a beautiful place. A lot of green. This is from January to December. So those who want to join us for a pilgrimage, please feel free. God bless you, dear friends. Continue to pray for one another. And thank you for praying also for my intentions. God bless you.